We are not at war, but Zelly is not very happy with that fish person. Uh... Okay, so building a mine is very simple. You just... There we go. Some planks and some things. We'll put a door here. Another door here. We have one bit of iron for this mine shaft. This mine... All it's going to produce is cubes of clay. Well, I mean, that is useful for when we run out of clay, but we're not out of clay yet. How can I get glass? Okay, there's only one thing to do. Going to have to look around and try to find something. What the hell is this? A half dozen bandits have set up a nearby camp. Because I need to. Uh, these foreigner people are just, what's this? Oh, I found, uh, Hematite, Malachite, whatever. <sighs> but I do need to, I need, what I need to, what is this? Zinc and sulfur. Green grass. Take it. Oh no, I, I refused it and I wanted it. Oh. And I really wanted that. <laughs> I was hoping for the glass I need to build a naturalist place. Although, here is a good spot for another mine. Once we finish constructing this one. And this will not be a horrible one because we can get cubes of clay. Uh, I just need to. Yeah, continue. I unfortunately need to figure out how I'm going to do this. That's a lot of planks that we're going to need. Do we have enough planks? Oh, we have planks. We don't have enough wood, unfortunately, to replace all this. So. Half dozen? I can't. Well, what do you want me to do? I have three people with guns. Uh, there's nothing I can do. Oh, hematite and coal. Still no glass. I need sand. Where's the sand? Sand. Somebody pick up the iron and use it in the mine shaft before they come and take it. <laughs> come on. Well, at least we're getting food. What can I do? Somebody is sleeping in the middle of the day? Bandits! Yeah, oh, oh no, don't take my bricks. Don't take all of my bricks. No, no, not the bricks. A hey, Aesop, hey, let him go. Aesop. Hey, not the, oh, Rook Drusilla is, oh, cool. So the, oh, the taking, oh no, don't take the stuff I have plenty of. So the bear thing is not set to where only they would do it, but it does look like the push-ups are increasing the... Yeah, because she's a regular now. 
What the hell? Why the hell are you not a regular Zelda? Is it a trait thingy? No. Zelly just isn't doing the push-ups. Drusilla's showing you up, man. Not that. We need the food. All the planks. All the. I think we have plenty of wood. So what I'm going to do now that it's become dangerous is I'm going to turn. Huh. Okay, so probably what happened is when I assigned him to a barracks, it closed out all of his other stuff like that. Which is why it wasn't hunting. Okay. Two forwards for that. That stuff looks delicious. And uh, we don't have anything to. No. Ending the day, we don't. We don't have anything to cook for. Pumpkin stew. And pumpkins are easier than... Uh, okay, so cabbage, wheat, and bread, which are the three renewable food sources we have, should be my top three on this list. So that they're constantly making it. Yeah, you should be making the you should be making this stuff constantly. And why are they not done with the mine yet? Are we out of rocks? Uh, God, no. We have more rocks than I know what to do with. Well, I want them to finish building that first. We have plenty of wood now, at least. Oh, yeah, we got lots of wood. We do have... Okay, hematite can be turned into iron. Malachite can be turned into copper. So this is coal and iron. Both of which are cool. I guess we'll have to hold off on the naturalist office because I don't, uh, I mean, I don't have anything to do. I don't, what I want to do right here is I want to mine all these surface nodes. Well, I can't conduct a meteorological survey because I don't have anything. The bandits are leaving, thank God. If I can get coal and I can get metal, iron stuff, and then I will be able to. Excuse me. Yes, send me more colonists. Has questions about our supplies. A letter. Oh, a command of ball of gold. Excellent. What's this? And notice some oddities. Extra supplies around a local server. Colonists will decide. Gods, I'm being insulted. You can decide. I knew there was something how badly this. If you want help, I'll ask, and I'll be sure to mention. Cover up. People get so worked up. Well, there's no proof, so screw you guys. Yes. All of these important resources. We're gonna need another stockpile, actually. And I wanna disable food and drink, but everything else can be fine. Okay, we're building the clay mine, which is fine because uh, we don't really need it, but. What am I going to do, though? I don't have any glass, so I can't make my own. 
I'll just have to hire a naturalist for a couple of days, but... Damn, damnation. Stupid crops. Stop spoiling. Why are the planks just standing in the middle of nowhere? Oh, that's our ball of gold, which I don't know what we're supposed to do before. I know you'll be able- I think this place right here. Mine complete. Yay. Not the eligible fans, but anybody else who wants to do it. Yeah, might as well. Missed. I don't know how long this video's been going on, actually, because I haven't been keeping the best track. So hopefully it hasn't been going on too badly. And if it has, hopefully you're enjoying it. So what are we going to do now, actually? We have... We are slowly but surely mining all of this good stuff. And I'll build another mine so I can get coal and hematite and maybe some sand can be kind of random I just I've never where well, I can't get any sand I need one of those naturalists but to get sand to make glass but I can't get a naturalist without glass so what to do what to do We've exhausted all those rocks, but we have 50 of them, so I think that's a good supply for now. The next house will probably go up here, just because that way I'm spreading people out. Huh, something to do, something to do. Oh, they're gathering all the wood. And we have okay, we have plenty of the most basic resources, which is wood, and we have no food. Food is a very big necessity at the moment. I cannot stress to you guys how important it is that we get some food. Fortunately, the pumpkins are coming in, so that that uh, help. Okay, the iron's already put into the mine shaft, and there's not enough planks up here, but there's plenty of stuff. And they all starting to gather the ores that I'm getting from here, so that's good. What to do about more food? I can place another farm, but the problem is since the crops are still spoiling, I don't think it's a good idea. So what can I do about food? Yeah, come on, replace all that stuff with stuff that's actually useful. You know what I'm going to do about food? You know what I'm going to do about food? Disable construction, disable mining, Disable, well, I'll keep foraging, but farming, forestry. I'm gonna just, the, no, the eligible fans are just going to, well, that does not help because they are. Yeah, the truthful furnace, now you have a workshop, you have a workshop, you have a workshop. Do you have a workshop? Okay, the... The eligible couplings do not have a workshop and they're falling off down the list. So, go disable your construction, disable your mining, and disable your forestry. All you can do now is farm, forage, or haul. In fact, I'm going to disable that too. So now we have two people dedicated to farming who will be working really hard just to get farm done. And our clay supplies have been assured now. So. 
Yeah, I think the problem is that they're getting so hungry because I'm not producing food fast enough that they're eating the raw food. Mineshaft is done at least, though. Chop that down because I'm probably going to. Although, I'm going to need to put a corn farm up. Especially now that I've got a dedicated work crew just to farm. Just to farm. And let me write that down. I, I've got a little cheat sheet with only a couple of the little things. but Okay, the eligible couplings are going to only be farmers. That's all they're going to do. That's all they are going to do. Farm only. I mean, I don't have anything for the science people to investigate, so there's nothing to do about that. I mean, people are just standing around in the kitchen because they're hungry. I'm a little low on beds again. And we're getting plenty of boats at class, so I'll probably build another medium, cl middle class home. But now we have two people permanently farming. So I'm going to go chop that tree down, then I'm going to get rid of the stump, then I'm going to put a corn farm up. I'll build a new mine shaft right here, and that will ensure heavier industry. And then I can get a metalworks up. What am I going to do with the metalworks? I'm not actually sure. I'm not actually sure what I can do with the metalworks, to be honest. Uh, I'll probably have to put in a fertilizer. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. I think having a crew just to farm and forge is good. Don't know why they're not picking that stuff up. a lot of space but this is going pretty well actually it's going better than most of my playthroughs never gotten this high up the tech tree before mineralogical survey some kind of badlands wow look at all that rock Hopefully, there's nothing horrible out here that wants to eat us. Uh, but they're working. I want them to clear that. And I want them to start catching up on their food production before I, you know, make them work too hard. How did it spoil when he's working on it right now? I mean, seriously. Okay, well, I've only got two people thus far assigned to just farm, and people are sleeping too. Need more beds. That actually can be the next project right now. We'll go build just a simple, lower class house. Just a simple lower class house right here. It's not going to be much. But 
but it's going to really help with the bed situation. People working in the mines? Fanny's in there. I guess you can only go in one at a time. Don't actually know. What do you want me to do? I don't even have a fully trained or equipped militia. That's what we need to do. That's what we need to do. I need to work real I need to get that new mine up, get the metal works up, and then I need to build uh arsenal the stuff I need so I can have an actual uh army defending me. Oh, they're gonna take my gold. There you guys go. Almost got enough logs and enough stone. And we have plenty of both. See, I'm not really I don't really care about the bricks. I don't I can't even use the bricks faster than I can make them. Here come the bandits. Someone's gonna pick up that gold, aren't they? Oh my god, they're leaving the gold. Ha, you guys are idiots. I mean no, no, please don't don't take our flax or our bolts of cloth or our bricks. How will the colony survive without these things? There we go. Clear that stuff. Okay, they're taking some metal wool, which sucks, but also some bricks, which does not suck. I'm about to build a mine shaft there. Who cares what they take? Yes, I know my prestige is so low, it's better not to ask. We are going to get a fully equipped... There you go. We will get a fully equipped militia though, and we will teach these guys what for. Come on, Percy. Need to help, buddy. There you go. I don't know what to do with the coal yet, but I'm sure it's good for something. Oh no, they're taking more bricks. However, will we survive? I'll play one more day, because I'm not sure how many days I've been playing this for. I mean, well, how long the days have been playing. Still not enough. Okay. But, uh, zone... And we're going to grow corn. And then I want to go here. And I want to put corn really high up the list. First of all, we need the variety, and second of all, we really, really, really. So that'll help. I would increase the loads if I had uh, too much food, but I don't have too much food. What are you guys doing? Did I tell them to do that? I think she's just doing it on her own. Uh, they're so hungry that they're foraging on their own. That's not good. In fact, that's horrible. Well, no one is getting starving, at least, so the food situation is not too terrible. Uh, we need to build that bunkhouse. We need to work better on food. Is that bandit? I have no idea what they took, but they didn't take my gold, so screw you guys, you're idiots. But we will... We will do something to help you guys. We'll let them forge as much as they want through here. Clear the stumps. 
sending a poet. Damnation. What the hell is good as he? Well, he can get me more prestige, so he's at least good for something. Uh, wants to kill another? No. Hoping to make a new friend. Upper class bed. Well, I'll tell you what. Once we get stuff settled, we'll think about upper class. Morbid. Ugh. And strange. Just plain weird. Okay. And they are building those cots. We are trying to mine all this stuff out of the way. There you guys go. Find as much of that stuff as you can. Should be people. What is this? What the f That's clear trying to be. I didn't mean to do that. Keep forging. Forge for everything. And butcher everything and grow food. Work your butts off until you get food. Do you understand me? If it's not edible, it's not useful. Yeah, they're eating the food before it can come to play. Just making them a little less happy, unfortunately. But, we all... I think what I need is... What I needed to do was I needed to start off with just having one group always farming, just farming. And what I also needed to do is I need to have slightly bigger farms. Also, cabbages should probably be the last of the main crops that you put in. I don't think they're that useful. There we go. We're starting to get this stuff. Henry, take it away. No, Henry, don't eat. Oh, Henry. Henry, 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 Henry. Well, at least you carry that one. What the freaking hell, Henry? How many? F how much food do you need? <sighs> okay, bed to make people happier. We are. Still working on mining all this stuff. Actually, you know what? The miners can do my the polite coffers can do mining jobs. What for? Polite coffers won't let you do mining jobs. Cause it's dumb to have a mining crew that won't do mining jobs. Okay, would somebody please take those sacks of flour so they can be turned into bread? Thank you so much. No, stop. Oh, thank you, Elijah. They were just eating every... Oh, God, they're eating everything. They're like ravenous little wolverines. I'm going to have to make another wheat farm. I need to amp up the food production, man. Let's get another small farm right here. And grow pumpkins there. Cabbages spoil too much still, so we don't need to be doing that. Come on, guys. Put your backs into it. Virtually nobody's idle, which is good. 
That's my poet. At least she's exploring. Breaking our backs trying to make this land grow food. But cots are being assembled, which is good. There you go. There you go. Construct. Ah, excellent. We will have lots of beds. Our company workbench has been damaged. Aww. Timber's the little thing, right? Yeah. Okay. Do not forbid the timber. Okay, I think we might actually have this food situation well in hand. I think we're doing better. Are those black cat mushrooms? Sapphire is the... Forge that stuff. I saw black cat mushrooms. Okay, so that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it as we are finishing construction of all the bed stuff. Uh, I am learning more and more about how to play this game. I hope I'm not embarrassing you guys too much. But uh, we're going to let everyone go to sleep. And the fields are looking much better now. Why? I have no idea. They just are. People are getting better at cooking, though. And we have a massive increase of beds. So that's 9 beds plus this 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So a massive increase in the number of beds means a massive increase in the number of happy colonists. Plus, uh, you know, if I can get a... What the Bandit set up. Continue our current policy. They gave me another effing overseer. I just... Okay, I don't need 14 pe work crews for 35 people. Okay? I should be able to... It should be more of a choice. It should be a choice. I should be able to choose... Would you like an extra... It's, whenever you hit a reward tier, it should give you at least two options of fairly equivalent value because if it doesn't then you end up with a third of your population being middle class and it shouldn't be that way uh, I should have a fairly large lower class a decent sized middle class and a very tiny upper class that's how it should be so balance is definitely something that needs to happen I still love this game and we'll be playing it more next session